Hey everyone, Miss A here. I just wanted to make one more video and touch base with you before your final this week. So our final is gonna take place over two days, same format as the first and second midterm. So on Wednesday, you will have your multiple answer and free response. And then on Thursday, you will have your multiple choice. And for that multiple answer free response, you're gonna to need to embed an image, just like we've been doing on discussions all semester. So make sure it is an image file, meaning JPEG, TIFF, PNG, PDFs, those aren't gonna work. Um, you wanna make sure that you are not over your storage limit on your Canvas account. I've mentioned that a couple of times um, and I will link that video that I made um, in the announcement below. So just check that you're not over. You can practice it on the sample exam. You can try embedding an image and see if Canvas will take it. But keep in mind, if you embed that image on the sample exam, it might push you over on, on your storage limit. So you just wanna check for that. I would also recommend that you clear out your browser history. Ooh, let me even back this up. On your browser, use Chrome or Firefox. I tend to use Chrome. It's not even tend, I use Chrome. Um, and clear out your history. I've, I've had so many like weird things happen on Canvas and then when I clear out my browser history, they go away. So sometimes they refer to it as clearing out your history, sometimes clearing out your cache. If you're not sure how to do that, just Google it and figure that out and get that done before you head into your exam. And the other thing I wanna mention is, um, please use academic integrity when you're doing your exam. This should be your work, not somebody else's. You should be using techniques from this class. So if you have a calculator command you're using, I need to see that in your free response write up. Um, and, and just a word of warning, those companies that, that provide answers, if, if I catch them, they will unmask you. So they'll tell me who you are and then I have to file paperwork. And it's just, it's not fun. It's not fun for you and it's not fun for me. So those would be my, my things. Um, make sure you've got your storage limit um, underneath, like at a, at a point where you can embed an image, embed that image using a JPEG or a PNG file, um, clear out your history and use academic integrity. And with that, that, that's it. I mean, we'll be done with the semester. Hopefully I'll have grades posted Friday, Saturday. We'll see how long it takes me to grade things. And then that, that will be it. And keep in mind, if you're not happy with your grade after you get the, this score, like let's say it's on Saturday, you still have the option to do the extraordinary withdrawal. Um, if you extraordinarily withdraw, nothing will show up on your transcript. And it doesn't count against that three attempts for taking a course. Um, you do wanna check because um, it could affect your financial aid. There's also the option to do pass no pass on any class, but again, check with a counselor because some majors need grades in certain classes, things like that. So with that, I, I just, I wish you the best of luck. If I, if I don't make another video before we get out of here, thank you so much. Uh, this was a stressful semester. I know it was for me and I'm sure it was for you guys as well. And I know we're not out of the woods, like we still, got at least another semester of this. So I just, I wanna say thank you. I'm very grateful for you and all the effort you put in. And thanks for putting up with me and my shenanigans for a semester. All right, take care. And I will, if you have any questions, just send me a message. All right, take care, bye.